that gives people something. Hey everybody, Outdoor Crafter again. Well, this video is not me doing the work this time. What a change. And uh, the project today is, uh, looks like it's no trespassing signs, the redneck way. A little bit of redneck ingenuity and uh, there's a few things here that uh, you could use if you don't have the proper things and just oddball stuff around the house. Looks like my buddy here, he's come up with uh, just a little, like an old jug of antifreeze coolant there just to make these kind of strips like a border all the way around this, as you can see here. Of course, this is the finishing product. Staked and all, real nice job. Okay, step in between, just an average uh, board here, you know, that you can use. As you can see, this is from piece. Here's the, the stake and a flying sign. <laughs> There we go. Oh, here he is here. All right, goes the, one of the signs. All right. Now we'll go cut some. Mm -hmm. use my wireless. Yeah, sometimes this is required in order to get the message across to people. Well, a lot of people, they just trespass on your property and they just don't care. So, if you have written permission stated on your signs, then they trespass and then there's a fine involved. You know? So, this will get the message across. So here he is, he's uh, cutting these things here. Real neat idea for borders. I might even do this myself. There. It's a little windy here today, folks. So I'll just hold on to this while my buddy is doing his work. Looks like he's using some tin shears there. That's redneck ingenuity, everybody, like I said. You make do. Number one. Six and four strips, I believe. Smart idea. Try this at home, everybody. It's amazing what you could do just out of scrap stuff. Why throw everything out when you could just recycle it? You paid for it anyway. You can see it doesn't take very long to cut those. Very easy to do as you can see. Not everybody has these materials, but you'd be surprised what you do have if you look in your garage. Making sure it's straight, looks good. Yeah, just take a hammer and tap those down, or a stone, or whatever you have around. Last. 
half that she's good as gold. Look at that. You're not good as gold. Oops. Oops. <laughs> got a three inch uh, stake this? Yeah. Yeah. So we got a confirmation on the thickness of this three inches. Nice. That'll stay there a long time. You know, see, just as simple as that. And then you end up with the finishing product at the end, like I showed you in the beginning. So hopefully, everyone, that uh, this tip has been very useful for you. And uh, maybe you guys can make your very own of these. Didn't cost my buddy very much. He had the stuff laying around his house. And uh, see you then, everybody. Till the next video. Bye for now.